In one word, how would you describe Clay Ball? Crazy. Crazy. It would be intense. Excitement. Intensity. Awesome. Intense. Go Aggies. Intense. Being in the yard, playing ball by myself, and, and just imagining that I'm playing in that game, you always live for it, and you knew the hype surrounding it. I think the guys, when they, they came into that game, they realized if things maybe hadn't gone as well during the season, it was a chance to redeem themselves in a certain way. We knew the community was dependent on us. Uh, the merchants talked about it. Uh, everywhere you went, they painted the town. It was really a big deal. Uh, I never forget, uh, after I graduated, they had a parade down here and they, they stopped the parade just throwing garbage at them, you know. And some guy from Montgomery called the Attorney General's office and, and he said, uh, look, the best I can tell you is just don't come through there on Thanksgiving Day. Coming into the stadium, you had to find walking room. I mean, you, even as a player coming out of the locker room, I mean, we had to squeeze through the fans. And once you get on the field, you, you look up and it's only standing room. Barely even standing room. And once that first kickoff, man, it's like, you could hear, hear the stadium all over the county. I guess that sport of, made it even a little more special. That, you know, it is somebody that I grew up with, I admired, and that makes you want to beat them worse. You know, a coach was hired to beat Lima, or a coach was hired to beat Ashley. You want to beat them? They right there. They're like, yeah. You got to go to line for eventually to the bank or something, or they got to come to Ashland to get something to eat or something. Like it's something you gonna see them. So you want to make sure that you are able to. Hey, you remember what happened? Believe it or not, they'd get there at like four o'clock in the morning and wait in line. I know that sounds crazy, but it, it honestly would happen when we played at Clay County. You know, there'd be people in line there, and you go through the school all day long, they'd just be sitting there, and when we'd go to line, well, that same thing would happen, and it was just amazing how, you had to get there early to get a seat. I'll tell you, what made it so rough, how many boys, wild boy boys, went over and got ass from wives. Yeah, that, that's pretty regular, pretty common. It was the ultimate event in Clay County, it was a social event of the, of the whole year. People would dress up, the ladies would dress up in their Sunday best with hats, and men would wear coat and ties, and you'd go, you go to the Lionel Ashland game. If you didn't beat Ashland, you didn't win a game anymore. You had to beat Ashland. That's all that mattered. I mean, you could you could win your region or whatever, but you if you didn't beat Ashland, that's all anybody talked about. You had to win the club ball.